They said Red Bull gives you wings. Oh my god! They lied. What is going on guys, my name is James or thanks see ya, and welcome back to another Minecraft mod spotlight and today we are going to be taking a look at the vending machine mod. So yeah, this is the vending machine and this is my vending machine corner because as you can see we have like, I don't know, people waiting in the queue or something. But uh, yeah, anyway, this is a slightly smaller mod from the ones that I've recently done on my channel but I am a firm believer that mods do not have to be these big, complicated, game-changing things in order to be fun and worthwhile. So yeah, this is a fantastic example of how a smaller mod can still be useful uh, for anyone who plays Minecraft. So yeah, let's take a look at what it does. So currently there are four drinks that are available from this machine if you feed in currency. And these four drinks, when drank, uh, will give you special effects depending on which one it is. So we're going to go through the crafting recipes very quickly, and then we're going to take a look at the drinks and I'm going to show you what they do. So the vending machine itself is a craftable item and is very simple in order to make this. You just have to go iron ingots around the side like that and then redstone in the middle and you'll give yourself a vending machine. And then the currency, which is on my bar here, we have iron and we have gold coins. So kind of like the, the iron one here has got a one on it and the gold one's got a five on it. So um, yeah, basically the iron one is the lesser currency, the gold one is the higher currency. You get 10 iron coins for this many gold, sorry, iron ingots, and this is the pattern you arrange them if you want to make your 10 gold coins. Much the same with the gold ingots, however, you only get 5 for 4 gold ingots. So it's kind of useful in terms of if you get to the stage where you have diamond tools and diamond armor, you actually have a use for your gold and iron ingots. So yeah, very simple. Currently, there is only one drink available for silver coins, and that one is called Club Soda. So yeah, let's take a look at that one first. So very simple, all you need to do is get your gold coin and right-click it on the machine, and oh my god, what did I do that for? That was so silly. Let me do that again. So yeah, there, there we go. Try not to demolish your machine whilst you're in creative mode, but uh, yeah, you actually do right-click it. I accidentally left-clicked then, but uh, yeah, this is the club soda. So this is the first drink available. Now what this does is it heals the player up to two hearts as well as clearing all potion effects. So this will clear every single negative potion effect, uh, I think, or actually... It says clear all potion effects, so I assume that to mean every single potion effect on your character. However, I'm going to kind of use it in terms of a negative, so for here, for example, we have a potion of poison. And if we- ooh, let me drink it all the way. There she is. So you can see here we are poisoned now for two minutes, however, Mr. Club Soda, if it is drank. There we go, it will disappear, and as you can see, my poisoning has gone. So that would be very, very useful if you find those nasty spiders that like to kind of poison you and stuff. Uh, the Club Soda will be kind of useful. Okay, so the next one here is done by gold coins, and now the extra three drinks are all done by gold coins. So currently there's only one with the silver, uh, or the iron coin, basically. Uh, hopefully in the future the mod maker will add more drinks and food and items and stuff that you can obtain. Uh, but currently, yeah, there's only one with the iron, and then the other three with the gold. So it's kind of random which one you'll get. I'm just going to go until I get all three of them. So there's the first one, there's the second one. There's a third one. Perfect. So here we have three. We have Mine Cola, which is the red one. We have F Up, which is the kind of like seven up looking green one. And we have Red Cow, which is obviously Red Bull. But yeah, <laughs> let's let's start with the Mine Cola. So the Mine Cola is a red one here and it grants the player a speed boost when walking. So as you can see, this is kind of like normal walking speed. However, if I drink one of these fellows, oop, there we go and I get the sugar. When I'm walking, I'm not even sprinting here at the moment, and I'm running very, very quickly indeed. And this is just me holding down, this is not me double tapping. So, for example, this is really useful if you're someone who likes to sprint around a lot. And I, as a Minecraft player, as someone who loves to sprint, however, I'm forever, ever, like, feeding myself with stuff. I'm like, porking myself away on, on pork chops and chicken and, and melons uh, constantly, because I love to run everywhere. So this will help you save on your hunger bar, as well as getting from A to B kind of fast. So the next one here is called F Up, and this grants the player the ability to climb walls. So this is really useful, especially if you're kind of faced with something like this, which would normally take a little while if the blocks aren't spaced properly. However, if we have a go with this, all we need to do is just hold the button forward, like just hold your forward button 
I am bound to double you, as I imagine most people are. And uh, yeah, you just climb the wall for you. So before you know it, you can be at the top of the mountain. And uh, yeah, this is kind of nice. Also, it would be really, really useful if you were traveling into ravines, up and down ravines. You don't have to do, like, the waterfall of death to try and get there. You can now use your fancy F-up drink, and you can get there relatively quickly. So I'm going to jump down here a second. Now, the final one here is the Red Bull-looking one here called Red Cow. And uh, this grants the player an extra jump boost. So, as you could probably tell, I mean, Red Bull gives you wings and all that stuff. So it does make you jump a little bit higher. It doesn't give you the ability to fly. However, the, the jump is... is Fairly high, actually. I think it's around... Actually, let's measure it here. Sort of one, two, three... Yeah, probably about three to four blocks. Uh, I'd go with I'd go with three blocks high. Oop, there we go. Three to four blocks high. A very nice high jump. Kind of useful, I suppose, for getting around. Can you do it while sprinting? Urgh, yes, you can. But uh, yeah, this will help as well in terms of, like, questing, exploring, getting from high ledges very quickly, jumping around. You can combine that with the F-Up drink and then have the Red Cow one and you can just move around like an absolute ninja. But uh, yeah, okay, so that is it for this mod spotlight. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Incidentally, if this is the first time you've ever seen any of my videos, my name is James, or thanks, see ya. And if you'd like to see a few more, it'd be awesome if you consider subscribing to the channel or checking out some more videos. That would be awesome. But yeah, as they always say, hate is gonna hate, but like is gonna like. So if you'd like to leave a like on this video, that would be quite nice. But until next time, thanks for watching, guys. It has been a pleasure. Thanks, and see ya.